Hello friends, welcome to our presentation about Moruboi rose hip. Rose hip is such a wonderful natural remedy. It's really a gift of God. It's so simple, growing in the mountains, we can harvest it and we can produce a wonderful natural remedy which is highly effective and we can apply it in different situations. It's easy to harvest, easy to produce, and it's so helpful. So it's the time now to harvest Moroboi rosehip. Time because it's winter in your place. The first frost has gone over because these berries need to be exposed to frost. After the first frost, they get somehow mature. When you touch them, they are a little bit soft. And maybe when you eat them, a little bit sour sweet. Then the right time of maturity has come. So we go and harvest and we dry them in the sun in a dry place. We dry them until they are like this. Dry, even hard fruits. You see, when I squeeze, I cannot squeeze them. They are really dry now. They are dry, a little bit hard. They sound like this when they are dry. When we have this product, the dry rosehip moroboi berry, we are coming to powderize them. And powderizing these moroboi berries, as you know, it's a bit challenging. And we have two methods. One is the traditional method. We just crunch them with a stone and then we powderize, 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 powderize. It's not so easy with the coffee machine to dry them. It's not so possible. It's better with the stone and prepare them. We need time and we have to filter them that it's just a nice, soft, regular powder. The other way to use it is the machine. There is a powderized machine, which you can buy for $80 in Alibaba in China, which will help you to powderize. We will show you how to use this machine and you get an idea how about. But first, let us say, why is rose bush so such a good medicine, rose hip? For two reasons. One, it's a perfect anti-inflammatory medicine for arthritis and osteoarthritis to reduce the invasive inflammatory reaction of the synovial sheet of the inside of the joint capsule, which is destroying the cartilage, to reduce this inflammation. And the other aspect is, it is full of nutrition. So it is vitamin A, B, C, E and K. So for these two reasons, we are using this medicine. Now let's, let's have a look at Dr. John, who is explaining you, you the powderizing machine. We have filled the um, container with these um, herbs here. We are putting in the, the electricity. Never touch the machine if you haven't detached from the electricity. And now we're going to grind it and it's making quite a bit of noise. <laughs> So once again, for precaution, detach from electricity. Open the container and it's making quite a lot of noise and be careful, never put your fingers into the machine. They're very, very powerful. So you open it and then you can see in there, you've got quite some nice powder, which we're going to filter again. So we got different sizes of filters. You can see here, uh, 40, me uh, 40 me uh, mesh, 100 mesh, 30 mesh. We have to find out how fine the powder we want. I'm sure. Th now let's have a look to an important detail. Widely there is the belief that the Moreboi berry shall be divided in the skin 
which is full of the vitamins, and you have to take out the seeds, these small hard berries inside. So people think because they are somehow itchy and they're so hard, you should not eat them. It is true, most of the vitamin C is in the skin, but, and there is the difference, a lot of vitamin E is in the seeds. And it's not good to throw away one of the most important part of it. It's the seed. It's so helpful. Therefore, when we dry and we grind the berry, we grind it totally with the skin, the seeds inside, and these little small hairs inside. They are no longer itching. So there's no problem. It won't itch. Then once grinded, the powder, we are filtering it with that thief, so that the powder is very regular and very, very, very fine. So we use this sieve. This sieve you can buy as well in Alibaba in China. They are not very costly and they are helpful for powderizing and have a regular density of the powder. What remains in the sieve is maybe bigger part, harder parts on those ones. These ones you can machine powderize again or we put them on the compost. So this is a small but important detail to consider. Now we have successfully grinded the rose hip uh, berries and we are getting this type of product. Look how fine is this powder. We put it into a jar and as always we label it with the expiry date. It is at least for one year perfect. Stored in a cool place in this clean hygienic jar. Now how are we using rose hip powder, moroboy powder? You take it just a teaspoon a day, one gram more or less. You put it into a cup of water and you drink it. Or you put it on a piece of bread with a bit of butter. You just powderize it on top. If you have a yogurt, you put it into yogurt. You just eat it like this. It has to be very soft, otherwise people can get difficulties with the teeth. You can put it as well in a spoon of honey, that spoon of powder. It's tasty, it's wonderful. So we take it like this, one teaspoon a day. Now for how long? If you are treating chronic inflammation like arthritis or osteoarthritis, take it at least three full months. To develop the full potential, it needs three months. You can go on, if somebody has a really chronic, chronic rheumatoid arthritis, they can take it for a half a year, then they make a break for three months, and then they, again a half a year. You can use it as a long-term treatment. If you use it in cases of malnutrition, even there, at least two months, together with balanced diet, enough vegetables, fruit if possible, and proteins. And then after two months, if the patient gets better, the symptoms, malnutrition are disappearing, then you can make a break. And then maybe three, four months later, you do it again. Or particular in the month, in the winter, when there is not so much vegetables and so on, then you can integrate it. For children, it's nice to put it into the milk, and so they drink a cup of milk with Muraboy powder. You can give it to children, adolescents, adults, and the elderly. There is no problem at all to use it. Enjoy your experience with Muraboy powder. Thank you for your attention.